Welcome to the beginning of the end. Hey guys, it's me, Heathykins, and here we are with our finale for the Phasmophobia solo challenge. We are doing the asylum today. Finally, the long-awaited, only large location, which we found out last time. The prison is, in fact, a medium location? Had no idea. I had no idea that was the case. So, the asylum has been abandoned for years. Its only occupants are the paranormal. It's a large location, recommended team size 4, and their recommended item is, of course, sanity pills. Because only an insane person would go in by themselves. Let's go. We're going to add everything that we need. We need a parabolic. We need all of the sanity pills. A thermometer. Um, we'll bring all the sensors. We need to know where this thing is. Sound. Motion. A strong flashlight. We'll bring all the tripods. All the smudge sticks. Salt. Uh, we'll bring four of those because I think that we have five we have five tripods and we it comes with one okay anywho um candle why not just one both lighters both photo cameras we're done I had tried this one before I, I did succeed but I mean I did try this one before and the recording got corrupted it was heartbreaking, but not this time. No, this time I've taken precautions. So this time we're going to succeed. Let's go. Okay. Here we go. Notes on the whiteboard. We might need them. Let's take the map here. Oof. Violence, huh? violence in an asylum hmm okay so we have our entrance we're just gonna walk right in there and then there's immediately hallways on either side which tells us that this lobby just takes us back around to one giant room so perhaps the best way to go about it is to try going into one of these hallways and seeing if any of the rooms spark any sound for us so, we've got thermometer, we got smudge sticks, EMF reader, Robert Miller. All right, Robert Miller. Let's see if we can remember that. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to write that down. I'm going to write that down. So that way, we don't have to remember it. Robert Miller. All right. We know the name of our ghost. We have our flashlight and nothing else. What do we need this time around? We need thermometer, parabolic. We'll start with parabolic, work our way into thermometer. Let's go. So, here we are. There's the light switches. I'm not worried about those right now because I don't remember where the lights trigger with this one. Do you work? Oh, this is the lobby. Perfect. Sh Shizy. What's this? Schwepsy? <laughs> I thought I heard a sound.
and some mostly for doors. Can you give me a sign? Give us a sign. up anything so far. I think these mean that I'm close to the stairs. Nothing so far. Give me a sign. go down, go back to the other side, come back around, make a full loop, Let's see what we find. Give us a sign! Give us a sign. I thought I heard something. Give us a sign.
Okay, I feel like we're getting closer. Perhaps it's upstairs. Yeah, we're close to the stairs, so let's head back up. It was coming from that way. Is it in here? No. Okay, let's try going up. Inside, it's past that wall. Must be the other side. Ah, here we go. There it is. It's in here! Ah, freezing temps and everything. Okay. So. Good. Good start. We're gonna leave that running. back. Beautiful. We found it. Ah, and we have freezing temperatures. So that's a great start for us. Freezing temps. How's our sanity? Pretty good, actually, <laughs> considering we walked around an entire asylum. That's pretty good. So 
smudge sticks. I'd like to set something up first before we smudge, but smudge sticks, now's a good time. Okay. Yeah, they open the door, they turn the light on. Pretty sure sign of... Uh, oh, they turn all the power off. Hopefully that counted. Ah, oh, it looks like it did. Beautiful. All right. So... Getting spike up to seven here. And a little bit less sanity. But we're pretty good. We're pretty good. So we're on this floor. Let me see. That doesn't look like the right hallway. No. There's the uh, lobby. I'm not sure where that is, but there's nothing to see there, it looks like. Stairwell, maybe? Okay. I don't see... I don't see where the thermometer was put in the hallway. Oh, that's a classroom. Yeah, I can't see where the uh, thermometer was left. Elevator, stairs. Okay, that's really bright, but that looks like that's leading into a hallway too. Uh, no thermometer in the hall. Another elevator. Another elevator. All right, so we definitely don't have the camera where we want it to be. So we're gonna have to bring a camera in this time around. I think we're gonna go ahead and bring... I'll take some sanity pills now. Me as well. We're Just top us off, keep us sane, but then we'll bring out a couple of things. Um, crucifix, camera. We'll put the camera down on the tripod. Let's put this down here. Did you not place? Okay, there you go. And we'll grab you. All right, let's head in.
<laughs> was not expecting it to play with the door while I was there. Yeah, it's just gonna play with the door. Okay. We're gonna need to bring in a camera. Let's see what else. We have brought in a video camera. We're gonna need a photo camera. And um, definitely UV light. I think we might have fingerprints. But it's definitely grabbing things. It's definitely grabbing things. So we will grab... Well, first let's take a look at the camera here. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. Let's see if we got any ghost orbs. We may have to change the view. I don't know how much better of a of an angle we're gonna get on this utility closet, but um here's here's hoping that we see something. Might have to put it inside and have it face out. Not seeing anything. Not seeing anything. Alrighty. So we'll move it, but we'll grab this guy. Oh, an EMF reader. We definitely need to bring an EMF reader. Okay, so we'll bring these. It helps that um, that they tend to turn on the water in the asylum. had a handprint on here. It just touched it. we go got an EMF reading not a big one but we got one yeah flip the light switch I don't think we're getting any fingerprints if we haven't already gotten them louder. Hmm. That's a four. Oh, a four, not a five. So not quite. Ah, this one's on now. It's traveling. Okay. 
Yeah, it's traveling. That's good to know. Yeah, I'll have to keep an eye out on that uh, EMF reader. It was at four. Hmm, keeps playing with the door. So I'm gonna go get more things. Yeah, hmm, it may give us an EMF 5 if it went up to 4. Alright, we got all three of those. So that's good to go. Oh, that's... Hmm. Not the best, not the best view of the room. It does keep moving the door. Maybe it'll close the door for me. Hmm. I don't know how I could get a better view of the room than the ones that I've gotten. But, so we'll check out the other things. Yeah, we're at 86. Okay, we'll check out the other things and uh, do process of elimination. So we'll put the book in there this time. It's starting to get really active, so maybe I think it, we could... Um, we could maybe do spirit box. I do want to grab a camera, though. I'm going to grab a camera, because if it's going to get really active, then... Uh, yeah, let's do that, that first. Okay. Head back over there with the book, and we'll come back for the spirit box. All the way over here. Fairly certain that's an EMF 5. picture here. There's a lot for you to play with, isn't there? Oh, that's a three. Maybe one more move with that. Maybe. It's still a three. That was ghost writing. Demon or Yure. What am I missing for those? Okay. Yure's ghost orbs. Demon is spirit box, of course. Of course. Okay. We're coming back with that spirit box.
Okay. Yeah, we're at 76. Any luck with ghost orbs? No. All right, let's grab the spirit box and we're going back in. Yeah, I did hear that. I can't believe that's not an EMF-5. Hold on. Spirit box, ghost riding, freezing temps. Ghost orb, ghost riding, freezing temps. This guy's probably a demon. Let's go confirm. Where are you? How old are you? There you have it. A kid, huh? Now we just gotta head back to the van. That is incredible. We made it through every contract without even a hunt. If I remember right, I don't think they hunted. I'll have to watch back through again. <laughs> okay, so we have a demon. Spirit box. Demon. And that is that. Let's see how we did. There you have it. Well, guys, that was it for this series. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. If you want to see some more Phasmophobia, let me know in the comments below. Subscribe if you're liking what you're seeing, guys. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you for joining me for this adventure through Phasmophobia. Bye-bye.